Welcome everybody to a new series on this channel and this series is called Drafting Dollars. Now what this, uh, what this series uh, kind of means is that I will be playing on FIFA 16 the new game mode out this year, a foot draft. Uh, so I will be playing the foot draft over and over again and uh, that is basically what I'm going to do. Uh, the foot draft will be explained uh, whilst playing it and whilst doing the team and stuff but uh, the kind of the you know, the meaning of this series is kind of to uh, get as much coins as possible by playing the foot draft. Uh, you kind of need 15k coins to enter the foot draft, so that is what we will be doing. Uh, you get one free draft token if you uh, start a new account. Not, not if you reset your ultimate team account, but if you make an entirely new account, you get one draft token, which we'll be using in just a second. Um, and then you draft a team, you play with it, you get packs. Now these packs are very very important to us because we, out of these packs we need 15k coins to enter a new foot draft. It would be kind of annoying if uh, the first time we did it that it wouldn't work and we had to start over again but probably I'll put some FIFA points on this uh, account to, so we at least play 5 foot drafts so uh, make sure that I put 4 like 1200 uh, FIFA points on the, on the account so we can pl uh, play a minimum of 5 foot drafts and then the coins will come in and uh, after those five uh, tokens that I will buy with FIFA points uh, there was no more um, FIFA points being used so since then on I need everything from my um, from my coins so and when the coins run out and we can't play any uh, any foot drafts anymore that's the end of the series now if the series goes very successfully our goal will be reaching 100k coins it isn't a lot, but by playing just a foot draft, that could be a bit difficult. So we'll see what we get. If we get a very good player in our first pack, then we'll bump up the, you know, the, the goal that we have to like one, uh, 500,000 coins or something. We, we wouldn't know. So let's get on to the gameplay. Now the first thing that we have to do is, uh, is obviously we have to choose a club name, and of course it would be drafting dollars because that is the name of the series, but. I misspelled it because we had one uh, letter too short so I had to remove the space but um, after this we're going to jump in straight to the foot draft. Now the foot draft, uh, as you can see I had that one stand there and that's one foot uh, token so yes I gotta use that and we get five different formations and I choose the one that I play best with and it was a 4-3-3. Now we get our three captains, uh, five captains and you obviously choose the best one and it was Ronaldo and in this foot draft I do get a lot of bad players. As you look at that, there's, there's a second time in the row that I get absolute dog shit and well it kinda affects me playing and during this draft uh, drafting I didn't really know where it was gonna go because Serie A is a kinda dangerous uh, league to get into so I wasn't pretty sure what to do whatsoever and I kind of felt that this team wouldn't be that strong. Now I do get Neymar and other stuff, but I do have Ronaldo already there, and it was just a big, big struggle. Now, uh, now further ado, I would check out like all the Serie A players that we could have gotten and all that stuff. And you know, th this team wasn't the most amazing team that we could get, but uh, I, I tried to make the best of it, as you can probably see. And I'll probably you know fade away to the the team that we actually have gotten. Um, you know, a little bit of spoiler. Uh, we're do we do gonna pick up Team of the Year Neuer, which is quite the good goalkeeper. So that's quite a nice to get, after all. So this is the team that we end off with in the draft. We only had 89 counters, so it was a bit you know, a bit on the worst side of the thing. But we do have some nice players in there. Not the best of them, but we did have some nice players. And our first opponent that we come up with had a not that great of a team as you can just see in one minute. He has 69 chemistry, ha, <laughs> cap, yeah, we all know that joke. Um, but he does have a great player, some informs, uh, Aubameyang, Di Maria, De Bruyne, Sterling. So I was, you know, I was worried because that first episode on your, on your new series wants to be a good one. So uh, I started off doing the very nice job with Kondrevi here. Triple tap it and, you know, his, his defender chipped over the ball. I can't take the full glory of this goal, but I was kind of happy that um, EA gave me a sign of luck in this draft. So with that goal, I, they said to me like, you're going to win this draft, you're going to have a good series. So I said exactly like, thank you EA Gods for being with me. And even like just uh, in the 20th minute, another goal from 9 goal, and an absolute stunning finish into the uh, far post, uh, into the far right corner, uh, far left corner, I'm sorry, I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. but. 
Um, I will be messing up a lot in this series, and you know the goals will be keep keeping coming in the in every single clip that you will see because I, I scored way too much in this game. I, absolutely, way way too much um, for the first round. Uh, it's quite a an, an nice opponent to come up against because I'm pretty sure that I'm going to win this round when I was already 2-0 up. So it gave me a very nice feeling about the further status of the draft. So that was pretty nice and we do pick up a, uh, a penalty kick with Ronaldo in the, in the break of the halftime. And you know, I'm going to give it to Higuain because he's a nice striker. I want to give him some confidence in this stream because a good striker is always the key to success and he finishes it very nicely. And that was, you know, that was the first half. And even like right into the second half in the 51st minute, we did get another penalty. Uh, but this time, I think I gave it again. I think I, I think I left it to Ronaldo this time. I'm not sure anymore. But I think I did uh, because, you know, my 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 attackers do have to have some confidence. Just like I said a few seconds ago, it's very important that you can rely on your strikers. So uh, I was pretty keen on giving his. Uh, this one, or it was even contrary to my other, my other attacker. But you know, I did the Penanka because I wanted to mug him off, just because of this easy, easy game. But you know, I don't, I didn't want to assault him. But I was very confident going into this game, uh, into this uh, game in the first minutes. I wasn't that confident, but after all, I did get very, very comfortable. And it does finish 5-0. So that was the ninth minute. We did win our first round of the draft. That means we don't get the worst packs that are out there. But we, need, we have to win some more rounds to get the best packs in this draft. So we're probably going to pick up uh, my uh, the new team that I, uh, I will be playing against. And that team will be this very nice build team. He does have Messi, uh, team of the year, and yes, uh, Dani Alves, and not even that Ronaldo at the left top corner. But, you know, he has some bad cameras. So I was I was pretty confident after the last game that we will, we will win this uh, one too. But, you know, I've made the mistake that I made uh, made couple of times earlier and he does you know he, he puts a nice pass through and I can't take it away from him I made the mistake and you know he, he take the goal he take the opportunity but I wouldn't go down without a fight so I got Dries Mertens here on the flank he does some nice kill moves get cutting inside and you know Dries Mertens just not giving in on this on this game and uh, he was very unfortunate not to score there but I was very lucky that Hernandez was uh, was waiting for the ball to just head it in into the goal so that was pretty nice and again Dries Mertens putting up uh, the effort given that um, he got in the, the ball to to have a nice chance on the edge of the box and you know he muscles himself off on the defender very very nicely and he's and he scores the goal that's just a plus point on he you can you can pretty rely on him when he gets inside of the box and he has some bit of space so that was very nicely and I thought Oh, we had a great chance here once again because I picked up the ball straight off the kickoff. But, you know, he defended very well and then he put some sort of this counter. It wasn't really a counter, but look at my look at my defending. I pushed forward way too much and I tried uh, snapping up the ball uh, way too quickly. But, you know, this cross, I don't know why it's a goal. It's a very nice goal because that flying kick from Messi does make it to the uh, to, to all in this game. Uh, but that should have never worked. Uh, it was a very nice goal. I really can't take that away from him. But the the cross shouldn't be connected to Messi whatsoever. So that was a pretty pretty shit thing. And now, uh, now I thought that it would be you know our moment to shine. But you know he's getting a bit lucky. And look at that strike. A real life player cannot score that kind of goal in that position. He like he did he did it like a 90 turn or 180 turn, and he shot it in the in the in the top corner. So that was really a really 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 painful one. And no, this goal was a bit of a cheese too because of one of his players got injured and he stayed with his goalkeeper. So the offline uh, line, where the offside line, where that defender was drawn, it you know he took offside way out of that action, so I could pass it very easily to Higuain and finish that off. But you know, I'm me, the stupid guy that I am, I gave that guy a freaking penalty and I just didn't want to show it. He scored it, so I wanted to get the next chance. But look at that shot, dude. Look at that shot, and there was just one guy that could do that, and that is my guy, Higuain, making it for all, but unfortunately in the 90th minute, when we got a pace whore up front like uh, like Aubameyang, and they have a nice few passes in there, and Messi, you know, Messi in the edge of the box with his left foot, he's going to score that goal, and that will mean that we did lose our second round of the draft, so that was pretty unfortunate. And then to the moment of the episode, 
key packs that we get. We did get some pretty shit packs. We got two uh, gold packs and a jumbo gold pack. So these were the best packs that you could get. But you know, it's only the second round that we've uh, we've gone to. So and we even lost it. So I could not uh, complain about the packs that we got because they're the three packs we can sell some shit in it and. For the next episodes, all of that shit, I, I'm gonna do these live comps because when I ever get a good player in the pack, you wanna see my reaction, you wanna see all the things I do, you wanna see me spontaneously talk, so that will happen in the in the near future. I will uh, start recording these uh, a lot more because it's fun to do, you know, a draft is always a fun thing to do. Uh, but for this episode, I just wanna to talk to you guys because the rules and all that bullshit, you know, they have to be talked about, and we do get nothing in these packs whatsoever. I will sell everything that is uh, in these packs to get as much coins as possible to get those uh, to get those coins to get in the next draft. If we get to 15 um, K coins, then we'll just enter in the next draft. If we don't get 50 K coins, I got four um, I got four draft entries that I can use with the uh, with the with the uh, FIFA coins. Uh, no FIFA points. I'm sorry. Uh, so we got four of them. I'm gonna put those uh, points on that account, so that's up there. We got four entries with the FIFA points, so we still have a few drafts in this in this series. Although we could almost uh, not have any more episodes if we do not get good luck in packs. So we will have four guaranteed drafts, and then the ones that get worth coins. So that just uh, that's gonna go depends on the co uh, on the packs that we get and how far we get into the draft. But this will be it for this episode. I will be selling all that stuff and you'll see the, the progress next episode. I hope you do like the idea of this series. I know it's on YouTube a lot, but I want to do my own version of it and we're going to do a very good job. I hope so. So if you like the video, do, do leave a like. Subscribe if you to see more of this series and we've got some bl uh, Black Caps uh, videos on my channel too. So subscribe if you to see more of those stuff. And you know, guys, I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. <laughs>